Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How's everybody doing? Happy Wednesday. I'm sitting outside on this beautiful evening. I just got back from work and I'm so excited to record a video for you guys. Wow, today I wanted to focus our meditation around nature and animals. There have been so many wondrous, mystical, serendipitous events with animals in the last couple days. Even recording my video a couple days ago, I thought it was a snake next to me and there was this lizard that I've seen in my parents' yard. The crows were crowing so loud today in the studio that we could hear them throughout the entire day. And I also, you guys had such a wonderful moment the other night eating dinner with my family. A hummingbird came up and literally almost stepped on my shoulder. Like he was, or she was flapping his wings and it was, it took my breath away and I had to catch my breath actually. And it just made me think of this universe that we live in and the fact that we are not larger than life. There is so much life on this planet, so much energy, so much breath. Every living thing and being that we interact with has an impact on us. And I swear it was some kind of wonderful spirit message from the heavens above and from those looking down to help me on my path. And I'm sharing this with you to help you on your path that the more we open our eyes and become awakened with our senses and present in the now, these types of experiences will reveal themselves. I'm sorry, I'm distracted. There's a big squirrel over there. Um, and I think, I really think it's so magical when you start to realize that you're in the moment and truly soaking in everything around you, whether you're at a stoplight in your car or sitting in your backyard. So today, let's get started. As always, find yourself into a comfortable seat or if it's best for you and your body, you're welcome to lay down. Um, but we are going to take this time to go within and just to really clue into our environment and what's around us because as we cultivate the relationship with ourselves in our meditation practice, we open up our minds, our hearts, our bodies, our souls to a new level of enlightenment. And I invite you today um, to take a moment and get settled, feel the parts of your body that are touching the ground. And if you're sitting upright, um, roll your shoulders back, Allow your spine to feel elongated. Maybe even go ahead and stretch your arms up to the sky. If you're laying down, really try to stretch yourself out. Point and flex your toes forward and reach, reach, reach up to the sky. And when you're ready to drop in, um, feel free to close your eyes. And now take a nice deep inhalation and exhalation just a sigh of relief you made it here you're carving out this precious time that you deserve in your day to go within and find balance within yourself so as you think of an intention to set today be aware of your breath and the environment that you're in perhaps the intention that you'd like to set is around something personal to you. Maybe it's a goal or a feeling you'd like to have, a love relationship you'd like to manifest, or perhaps it's simply being present in the now, right here, accepting what is, honoring your blessings and having gratitude in your life and opening yourself up to the wonderment of what's coming and already feeling so much gratitude for that, which is on its way to you. <clears throat> As you identify your intention, open up your heart chakra, open up your emotional space, and just allow yourself to be vulnerable and feel. Check in today, how are you doing? How's your body feeling? If there's any bit of tension or stress that you can feel, 
go ahead and direct your breath to that body part, continuing on your own with breath cycles. I don't want to get too hung up on counting the breaths. I think it's a very personal experience, but whatever feels right in your container of a body tonight. Feel what's best for you. Feel the feelings your soul, your heart are responding to as you become aware tonight. And thank yourself for being present and giving yourself this gift as we open ourselves up to nature and animals and just the sounds and environment around us we realize the precious aspect of life and every creature on this planet the living beings our human energy the feeling we get looking up at the stars at night hearing the whistling wind realizing that this high vibration life and meaning on our path is full of all these beautiful beautiful living beings flowers the grass the trees all the animals and of course our loved ones the human beings all the spirits and souls and as you reflect tonight, I want you to allow yourself to just feel exactly what you feel right now in your body, whether it's joy, maybe it's simple relaxation and relief that you're able to be in a meditation practice and breathing as you're acknowledging the thoughts that come through and then letting them just quietly exit the brain and the mind. Just allow the wave to wash over us. And sometimes the wave might feel a little bit heavier and we may feel like it's more turbulent or more emotional, maybe stormy. And other times there's a calmness, a gentleness, a pristine, crystal clear type of energy that we can see clearly. And just noticing the sounds of whatever's around you in your environment tonight. Maybe it's beautifully quiet and the silence is really powerful. Out here in nature, in the backyard, I can hear the birds chirping. There's a wind chime that's been ringing. I hear the crows crowing, maybe a dog barking. As we bring our drizd or our gaze or our inward focus back within ourselves, we become aware of what's around us. And the more we're able to cultivate this strength and this inner knowing within ourselves of being okay, knowing everything's gonna work out. We are all on this path. We don't have to know all the answers. This is part of our life journey, taking step after step, sometimes maybe taking a step backward and other times really leaping into the unknown, like imagining just stepping into the, the newness that can become a huge part of our lives and the things that we don't even know are on the way. But as you become more inward facing and more observant of your own thoughts and mind, you become a much better listener. It provides clarity in the mind. 
and it allows us to focus on what's most important to prioritize. What would you like to see transpire? Maybe tomorrow, maybe in a couple weeks, or maybe in the future. And as we drop into our beautiful meditation practice, we're able to allow the thoughts as they enter to be acknowledged, not to judge, not to overthink, but to more focus and daydream on the positive thoughts and the joy that we wish will be coming on the car that we've been dreaming of. We visualize the color. What is it gonna look like? How's it gonna feel when I'm driving it? We focus less on maybe something that's not working or a limited self-belief or something that we're dragging forward from the past. And instead, we use our imagination to plant the seeds in the universe of exactly what we would like. And as you're aware of your own mind tonight as we're here, and again, the sounds around you and even within your own mind, just allow yourself to be knowing that you're held, you're comforted, and you're beautiful just as you are. And reminding yourself that each step takes us to the next part of our path. We have to trust and believe in ourselves, in our inner knowing, having faith, we know how to guide ourselves. And now, as you become aware of the room and the sounds and the environment around you, clue back into your breath for a couple more rounds of breath cycles before we close out our practice. Breathing in and breathing out soaking up the vibrant energy, the joy, positivity, excitement, and contentment, breathing out any frustrations, anxiety, or worries. Be proud of yourself for making an effort to go within and now bring your palms together in heart center and Anjali Mudra bowing your head chin to chest. Thank you for the opportunity to lead you in a nice meditation, focusing on the stillness and the environment around us and within our souls. The more we are able to understand our inner landscape, the more easily we deflect and we don't react to the external world. We save our precious energy and we cultivate the wonderful, beautiful being, the unique person that you are, that no one else is like. And we celebrate that soul each and every day. Namaste. Thank you guys so much for joining and welcome to any new subscribers. I would love you to like, share, and subscribe. Also feel free to comment below if you have any requests for types of meditations. I will be back soon for another one and until then have a wonderful evening and be well. Love you guys. Bye.